Hollywood, magic city of illusion. Home of celebrated personalities. West, Crosby, Dietrich. But what about the unknowns, the extras, the faces in the mob scene? Are they real, these people who wear numbers instead of names? Let us select offhand Hollywood extra girl number 1472. Take her apart and discover what makes her tick. To find her, we merely dial Garfield 3711 and get... Central casting. File room. Just a moment, please. From thousands of registration cards, we find her. Suzanne Emery, age 19, height 5 feet 4, weight 112 pounds. Brown hair, blue eyes. Clothes are the tools of her craft. Early to bed for that beauty sleep. Up at six, and always hoping that today will be the day Dame Fortune smiles and picks you from the mob. powerful urge keeps Hollywood's hopefuls everlastingly at it. Genevieve, why are you here? Everybody back in Birmingham knows I'm out here. They expect me to quit. I'm not going back there and be the laughing stock. How about you, Grace? That's what I said 14 years ago. Now I'm satisfied with a job. I've got three children to support. Goldie? What dreams, what ideals keep you here? I hung around New York so long I got to be a landmark. People used to point me out like the Statue of Liberty. I'm going to grab off some old guy with lots of dough. Suzanne, what about you? Someday, somehow, I'm going to be, well, maybe not a star, but a real actress. Pride, necessity. Adventure, ambition. From the ends of the earth they come, waiting for the magic call. Snap into it, girls. You're five minutes late now. The magic call that may mean the lucky break. However, the chances are a million to one against these girls becoming stars. Speaking roles in big pictures, such as the Crusades, require experienced stage artists. Players such as William Farnham, Hobart Boswell, Montague Love, George Barbier, C. Henry Gordon, Alan Hale, Joseph Schiltram, C. Aubrey Smith, Ian Keith, Henry Wilcoxon, Catherine DeMille, Loretta Young. Loretta Young and Catherine DeMille are the exceptions that prove the rule, having reached stardom without stage experience. An inexperienced girl like Suzanne has but one chance in a million. Let's give her that chance. Let's pick her out of the mob and see what happens. Mr. DeMille, all ready to go. Uh, I <laughs> hey, quiet, quiet, quiet. We're trying to take a scene here. We've got 4,000 people on this set. You people chatter like a lot of monkeys. Now keep quiet and attend to your business. Now, what's that girl doing over there with a 1935 headdress? You know, this isn't a fantasy, this is history. Well, of all the... We spend thousands and thousands of dollars on research. We comb the museums of the world. We scour every library there is to get accurate and authentic detail. And they give me a girl that looks as though she'd just walked out of a beauty salon. Assistant director, one of your men, Tate, McDonald. Yes, sir. What's the idea of having a girl come on a set like that without a wig? To her won't show, sir. Have you got a lot of people on the set here that won't show? If you have, get them off. How do you know they won't show? Get that girl into a wig and forget the alibi. Yes, sir. Right away, sir. All right, now you people. You townspeople over beyond the gates there. Yes, now as these crusaders come riding through, 
You're seeing a great movement, a great sweeping forward of these men who are leaving you, perhaps for all time. They're your fathers, your brothers, your husbands. Let me see that in your faces. Come on now, work yourselves into, into the emotion of such a scene. Don't be extras. Be a nation watching its manhood ride out on a great cause. The crusade. Are you ready, Tate? Already in turning, Mr. DeMille. All right, now. Give me everything you've got, you people. Ready now? Right. Come on, come up to it now. Speed, 957. Places, everybody. This is a tank. Where's the set? Right. Camera. Okay. A Tate? Yes, sir. I'm going to set up now on a reverse angle of this same scene. Trucking shot. Okay, sir. Uh, here's a yeah, Emily, give me the script. Now. Oh. Here. Yeah. Here. Yeah. Oh. You're the girl with the wig. Haven't been in pictures very long, have you? It seems long, Mr. DeMille. Almost a year. Oh. Uh, what's the num number of that next scene? B-42. Uh -huh. What's your name? Suzanne Emery. Expect to see it in electric lights, I suppose. I did once. Discouraged? Sometimes. But maybe I'll get a break someday. <laughs> maybe you will. Well, boy, get me a chair. I can't sit up all day. My heels get tired. You know, I have a daughter in pictures, too. Yes, Catherine DeMille. She's lovely. Yes, sweet girl, isn't she? I know what uh, a girl goes through. As a father, I have the opportunity to judge at home. I know the heartbreak and the worry and the, the mad yearning to succeed. As a director, I should tell you that uh, you haven't got one chance in 10,000. But as a father, I tell you to stick to your guns, to win, to be true to your ideals. But when your chance comes, if it comes, be sure you're ready for it. That means work. That means there's a lot to learn. The whole technique of the screen is a very, very difficult art to acquire. It isn't just coming on and looking beautiful and being a tomato mouth blonde. It's learning a great art and how to express that fire within. You see that you're ready when your chance comes. Good might. Well, uh, what do we do tomorrow? The pilgrims entering the holy city. Oh, that's a great scene. That's a scene that, that, that calls for truth. Successful entry of the crusade into the holy city. I need some faces there that, that show souls through their eyes. That show deep feeling. True belief. Your eyes seem true. I believe I could use that smile of yours. What's your name? Suzanne Emery. I might be able to put you in that... Anyway, make a note of this uh, uh, girl for me tomorrow. You all right, sir? I might even use it for a close-up. Dream on, little Miss 1472. In a few hours, a new day dawns. A day that may turn those dreams to realities. A day that may discover you basking in the brilliance of fame. But if you fail, there is always home. Your friends. And a certain young man back east will be waiting for you. Whether you're a brilliant movie star or just Hollywood extra girl, number 1472.